space? I know I sure have. When astronauts are launching to space, re-entering orbit, or even just navigating through space, it's very important to make sure that they're not only comfortable, but that their seats are maneuverable. Their seats play a vital role in not only keeping them safe, but ensuring that they are comfortable the entire time. Fun fact! So, the shuttle program was the cause of many innovations, with the seats being actually one of them. The new missions entailed a lot, so the new seats had to live up to the strict requirements. The materials had to be extremely lightweight because the heavier your spacecraft, the more fuel and money it'll take to do the job. The seats are equipped with removable cushions and mounts for biomedical monitoring, emergency equipment, in-flight stowage, and communication connections to the crew altitude protection system. The pilot and commander seats are non-removable, but a mission and payload specialist seats are actually collapsible. So during a mission, they collapse and they're stowed at mid-deck. So astronauts encounter some really extreme forces. So in order to protect them, keep them safe, and strapped into place, two harnesses can be found right here, two shoulder harnesses, and a lap belt restraint goes across the waist in order to protect them and hold them into place. The shoulder harnesses have an inertia reel lock and unlock mechanism that allows the harness to move. So the pilot and commander seats can be adjusted in any direction to make sure that the astronauts fit comfortably. So race car seats have a few similarities, but majorly they have a way different purpose. Similarly, the drivers of jet propulsion vehicles are going to experience some really high g-forces. So right here you can see there's slots just like the other seat for shoulder harnesses and a waist harness. So the drivers in the same way as astronauts have to be really strapped in to their seats to make sure that they're safe throughout the run because any kind of movement could cause a crash or it could cause the driver to be hurt and we don't want that. However, these seats are actually made for very different purposes. The types of forces and environments that a racer may encounter would be a lot different than that of what an astronaut might encounter. Racers have to be prepared for fast and instant crashes, more so than really long survival crisis-like type situations. So these jet dragster seats that we have right here are actually made using a fiberglass shell. So an energy absorbing open cell foam is inserted into the shell and molded around a driver. After that, a layer of fireproof cloth called Carbon X is added to the outside. Fun fact number two. So this foam is made from a fire retardant material. NASA and a Florida Tech professor collaborated and discovered how to install that fire retardant material on a molecular level during manufacturing. So these fire retardant molded seats actually protect the driver from moving around or in the event of a crash. So it will also protect them in the event of fire. So I think I'm going to test out how comfortable this dragster seat actually is. Thanks for stopping by guys!